Hello, friends, family, and America. What up? Late night. Hello, East Coast. Hello, West Coast. Hello, Midwest. Hello, everybody. I got a question to ask. Anybody get their fill of 9-11 propaganda today? I know I did. You know? And just the feel of it, you know. Hey, America, you know, celebrate 9-11 with us, and we'll show you exactly who's responsible for it. You know, i.e. your Rockefellers, i.e. Your, your George Bushes, you know. Hey, hey, football fans, you know, get all emotional about 9-11. Don't even know that your freedoms are eviscerated. What do you think about that, huh? Oh, yeah, buy it in. USA! 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 Oh, yeah, you're just cheering it on, aren't you? Oh yeah, I see it happening. Do you? Got preps? Got preps? Hey, hey all you folks out there chanting USA, got preps? How's your 401k looking, huh? How your job situation, huh? You know? How's everything looking for all you USA? USA? Oh yeah. Looking real good, ain't it? Not saying that you don't have to have fun. Not saying that you shouldn't enjoy recreation. I'm not saying anything like that. All I'm saying is pay your fuck attention, folks. While you USAing, you know, TSA is up in the scanning, you know. Banks is just, you know, bringing us into austerity measures. They talking about another set of bailouts. You know, USA, USA, USA. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right in your face, huh? You know? Why y'all cheering? Why y'all sitting on the sidelines being some... <laughs> being them uh, standby lifers, you know? You know, you, 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 you li you're living life on the sidelines instead of living your own life. <laughs> yeah, I'm talking trash about you. <laughs> yeah, I am. That's me, dog. That's my job, dog. I'm supposed to point it out to you. Get mad at me. That's cool, man. That's real cool. That means you can still feel. I was watching a movie the other day. Actually, yesterday, matter of fact. Uh, I'm not sure if y'all hip to this, but Equilibrium. Remember Equilibrium, Christian Bale, Tay Diggs? You know? Check that out. Again, watch it. That's what's happening. You know what I'm saying? Get it through your head, folks. It's all propaganda. It's fun to enjoy a sporting event. It's fun to... Take some time off and relax. You know, that's all fun. You can do that. But do you got preps, folks? You know? How much dough? How much water you got? You got some alternative currencies? How much food you got? You're probably going out to eat every night, huh? Gonna be a sticky situation for you, won't it, when stuff really goes awry? You know? Now that we're talking about 9-11, let's talk about one more thing. And that is this. Next natural disaster, terrorist attack, it's stuff like that that happens. Can you are you gonna be panic buying? You gonna be running to the store? <laughs> How come nobody told me? What you gonna be doing? Ask yourself that question, huh? Let's say the electrical grid went out. You had a just like what happened in Detroit over uh, Memorial Day, um, over excuse me Labor Day. You know, you got enough food that's going to last you for four or five days where you don't feel a crunch. You got candles. You got flashlights. I mean, seriously. You know why you're throwing on your favorite team's jersey and you go on there hooting, hollering, painting in your face and the whole nine, you know? Can you survive that type of situation? I'm asking. If you can, more power to you. If you can't, looks like you got something to do, doesn't it? So I'm not here to make fun of you. Actually, yes, I am. But I'm not here to, to to be condescending towards you. But what I'm here to do is make you aware of some things. And just do it, folks. Ask your grandma. If Ask your grandpa. And they'll tell you. We used to put stuff away on a regular basis because we never knew what could happen. Again, so while you out there celebrating... And, and thinking about those who, who passed in 9-11 10 years ago to the day. Think about your situation now. And if it was to happen again, would you be prepared for it? That's all I'm saying, baby. Saffro Prepper, I'll catch you on the flip side. And guess what? 
There's no turning back now. Holla at me. And get mad, too. You should. Because you ain't prepared. I know I am. Shirts coming soon, folks. I got the shipload of shorts or of shirts, and uh, I got them at a great deal. I need to get them screen printed. Um, that and I got another uh, order that I'm about to place on some more stuff. So I got a little bit of merch coming you guys' this way. I'm gonna be giving some of it out. I'm gonna do some contests for it and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, folks, it is what it is. Stay prepping. Stay confident. Keep your head up and. Um, Keep it moving, folks. Afro Prepper, catch you on the flip side, fake. Baby!